Well, some hopeful news surrounding the pandemic. For the past three weeks, confirmed COVID cases, they've been on the decline here in Georgia since reaching a summer peak on August 21st. But as CBS 46's Rebecca Schramm shows us, some people are still battling COVID months after recovering. Every morning I wake up feeling like I have the flu. April Cotney tells me her life is much different since she recovered from COVID in January. She has memory issues. She can't drink coffee or have a glass of wine anymore because it makes her heart race and makes her feel even worse. I still can't smell hardly anything. And taste? I taste about... 60, 70% of the time. Sometimes she feels like she's about to faint. And then one time I was driving on 400 and I actually pulled over when I noticed that I, that was happening. With no clear answers from doctors, she joined a Facebook group called Georgia COVID Long Haulers and realized a lot of people are having some of the same issues. Researchers at Emory believe some post-COVID patients' problems could stem from damage to specific organs, such as the heart. Others could have issues stemming from chronic inflammation or a breakdown of checks and balances in the immune system. It's why they're recruiting more doctors and collaborating with other researchers to better understand what's causing long haul COVID. And I'm, I'm trying to get in with them as well. So I am very happy, very happy they're doing that. If you are interested in learning more about the research Emory University School of Medicine is doing on long haul COVID, we've got information in a story we've posted on our website, cbs46.com and on our CBS 46 app. In Atlanta, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News.